King Charles and Queen Camilla faced a potential security threat during their visit to St. Helier, Jersey, shortly after an assassination attempt on former U.S. President Donald Trump. The royal couple was quickly escorted away from an open-air expo when a security personnel spotted a suspicious individual on a rooftop overlooking Liberation Square, where Charles and Camilla were greeting well-wishers. The couple was taken to a nearby hotel to ensure their safety. There was a small issue of concern, an investigation turned out to be a false alarm, every precaution was taken, and the program resumed shortly afterwards, a royal source told The Sun. The suspect was confronted by police, but no action was taken after a background check revealed no threat, and the incident was deemed a false alarm. After the situation was resolved, King Charles and Queen Camilla returned to meet local schoolchildren and attended a tea party as planned. The increased security measures were implemented in response to the recent shooting at a Republican rally in Butler, Pennsylvania. During the rally, Trump was delivering a speech when he was shot in the ear by 20-year-old Thomas Matthew Crooks, who was positioned on a nearby rooftop. Crooks was subsequently killed by Secret Service snipers. The attack also resulted in the unintended death of a volunteer firefighter and injuries to two other attendees. The swift actions of the security personnel ensured the safety of King Charles and Queen Camilla, allowing them to continue their engagements without further incident.